In this video I'll explain how to resample in logic. There are many different ways you can approach resampling. Let's look at our first example using Drum Machine Designer. Let's say you have created a drum kit with sounds you like, and want to take it a bit further by adding effects and doing some sound design. This sounds great. Now the problem with this approach is that all our drum samples will go through the same effect chain. To fix this we can select the sample slot we want to be affected and resample it. Logic will render the audio and create a new sample pad with our affected sample. Now we can reset the original sample and bypass all effects. And here's our resample cowbell. This is a great way to customize drum machine designer sounds on the fly and make them your own. Now let's talk about resampling master bus or layers of audio. First we can listen to the original track we're about to resample. You probably know that a lot of modern tracks are created by sampling others' music. Some producers, for example, use old vinyls to find pieces they like to reuse in their productions. Now imagine you've been working on your track for a while and you're not sure what to do with it or how to develop the idea. In this case, you could resample your own music and reuse it to create something new or extend the arrangement of existing track. In this case, I'm going to mute the regions I don't like to be resampled. Select the rest and press Ctrl B to bounce it. Now let's check what we've got here. Now I can drag this audio region to empty track space and select Quick Sampler. This way Logic will create a new sampler instrument with that region. Let's open this sampler and see how it sounds. Here you can adjust the transients and use all the samplers functionality to achieve the sounds you want. And through trial and error you can create interesting patterns. And just like this you can use your own music to create something new. If you like this video hit the like button and subscribe for more.